Hello everyone and welcome to the Carousel Pack. Hey, we have another Disney Character Warehouse update here at the International Drive Outlet. So let's go shopping. Carousel of Connor. So it's actually been over a month since I've been at this location here, the International Drive Character Warehouse. So let's actually go look around and see what they actually have new here compared to violence. I arrived at the Disney Character Warehouse probably about an hour after it opened around 12 p.m. I walked right in, everyone was walking right in. But at the time I was leaving, people were actually, you know, kind of lined up for the store. You could not just walk in. We are weeks away from Halloween. And they actually have Halloween kind of jumping right at you on this main table here. They have these bags, which they will have over at Vineland. But over at Vineland, they were actually $24.99. Now they're $12.99. So these are back to half off here, which is really nice. $12.99 for those. And if you guys are enjoying this Disney Character Warehouse update here at the International Drive Outlets, do not forget to hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and ring that bell. And then they have these little like mini cups here too. I think these are cuter than the ones they have now. These are $4.99, so $5 each. These are kind of cool decorations. I feel like you could do a lot with these too. They have some of these flower and garden cups here, $3.99. Not a lot of them, only four left. And I've shown these on past Character Warehouse videos. If you want to see any other past Character Warehouse merch, I'm going to link my Character Warehouse playlist right here so you guys can go and check that out if you want. And just like over at Violin, they still have like the nail polish, things like that, all $1.99. They have different kinds of those. They also have the 99 cent ear patches and the 99 cent bag to go along with it. And then they have this two size sequin shirt, blue here. They also had this over at Violin. This is $14.99, originally $29.99. And then they have Full of Spirit. This is the uh, Nightmare Before Christmas. I showed this in last week's video over at Violin. This is $12.99, originally $19.99. So over at Violin, they had the Matterhorn bobsleds, pop vinyls there. These are $14.99, but for $10.99, they also have the Rainbow Unicorn, which I know this was cheaper at one point in time. I forget how, much cheaper, but I don't remember this being $10.99. I remember being a little less than that. Now, I've shown these leggings before too, but what I think is kind of cool, these are $9.99 for the girls, originally $24.99, but you have like a whole little outfit here you could get too. And let's see, this is $19.99. I will be surprised if it actually is $19.99. So there you go, $9.99. So for $20, you could get leggings and a shirt, kind of matching outfit for 20 bucks. That's really not bad at all. Like I said, these aren't, you know, the cheap prices that we used to see at the Character Warehouse, but when you can get a shirt and leggings for, you know, $20 Disney merchandise, that's really not that bad, in my opinion. They do have these, like, mini shorts, too, for girls. These are $12.99, originally $24.99. So about half off there. All they have are extra smalls. As far as the rest of the girls, like, merchandise goes, they really have all this at Violent. I've shown this in past warehouse videos, like that Kristoff, you know, that's nothing new. Uh, you know, all of these Frozen merchandise, you know, between the like stationary kits plus the shirts and everything all this stuff is what we've seen in the past so over in the boys section this shirt is one i've not seen before i've seen a lot of cruise line merchandise in the past but i haven't seen this one necessarily this is the magic transatlantic 2020 599 so this is one of the cheaper shirts you will find here it looks like they got smalls mediums largest and extra largest and next to that shirt too is a magic of europe which i've seen that shirt before too that's kind of like what the front looks like that's a large, and let's see if that's as cheap. Yeah, that's also $5.99. And then they have a sweatshirt. This is the last one. I know we've seen this before too. That's kind of the main logo on it. That's really the only logo on it. It's dark blue. These are $12.99. So, uh, you know, kid's sweatshirt, $12.99. That's really not bad either. So the last time I was here, which was a while ago, they had this was all like Star Wars stuff. Now it is Cruise Line here. So a lot of this stuff, again, not nothing we haven't seen before. A lot of this is all at Violent, which we've seen in past weeks. And they do have a little small section over here of Star Wars, which this is nothing new too. We've seen a lot of these shirts before too. This Bounty Hunter one, which I see this in the parks all the time. I actually own this shirt too, $14.99. Originally $36.99. I think I bought it for like half of that though, around like seven bucks. And they have kind of like a matching sweater here too. This is $19.99, originally $49.99. And they've had this for a while. These are in smalls mediums and extra large and these shirts are smalls and extra larges and down here too it's all star wars merchandise too but a lot of these we've shown in our past weeks as far as some new merchandise too now we've seen these over at violin before the uh, brooklyn nets ones but we haven't seen la clippers they have the la clippers here too they also have the celtics which we saw over at violin but the la clippers are new it's the same price 48.99 here originally 80 dollars so you know again not you know, $48.99 is still a lot for a pair of shorts, but compared to what it was, $80, that's really not a terrible deal here. They also have the Rockets, which I'm pretty sure they had over at uh, Violent as well. 
but the one thing they have over here that they don't over there is a Vince Carter Toronto Raptors jersey team looks cool too it's just kind of like a vintage one it's like the older style which is pretty cool more throwback and these are 78.99 but look guys it was 130 at one point so that's really not bad uh, you know especially when, when you know you're talking about jerseys too it's a nice like sewed jersey too so it won't fade like super uh, you know easily and also too it's Mitchell and Ness which you know if you're asking me Mitchell and Ness is a very good brand I like Mitchell and Ness a lot uh, 78.99 again original $130 that, that's pretty cool they have a lot of these college shirts over at Vineland but this one I have not seen this one's pretty cool it's got a little bit of everything it's got pirate ships it's got Star Wars on here. I see the, uh, is that the Jungle Cruise? Oh no, it's just like the trolley being pulled by the horses. They got like the Speedway over here. It's a lot of different things. Pink shirt here, it's only smalls. And these are $24.99 originally, $49.99. This is a pretty cool shirt. I'm actually gonna make this the deal of the day. It's got like a nice comfortable, uh, like, kind of like, you know, fabric to it, I wanna say. And then I love the designs on it. It's a shirt that like has a lot going on, but like not too much. I feel like, like I, I like the color, like the subtlety of that. And twenty four ninety nine, so it's more than you know, like half off. Uh, you know, it is half off pretty much. Not bad. The men's section has some new items too, which is kind of cool. And over here, I see one new thing for the women's here. These kind of like, like I don't want to call them like like spandex shorts. I guess you could say these are thirty four ninety nine. I don't see a pre uh, sale price on these, so that's not saying that it didn't fall off or anything like that. But from what we can see here. $34.99 usually I would go and look to see if there's other ones around here and kind of compare and see if they actually have the sale price on there but this looks like it's the only ones left so for now we're gonna say this is $34.99 I did just ask the cast member and these are full price they do have these cool sweatpants over here too these are cruise line to you see Minnie Mouse with a little like captain's hat on and it's got like an anchor uh, the wheel everything like that and it's got like a little like tie around the uh, waistband too which is nice these are $19.99 originally, $36.99. They also have a new tank top over here too. It says Mickey Mouse on the pocket there. And it has kind of Mickey Mouse running on the bottom. Looks like they have mostly smalls here. And once I put that back up, let's check out this price here. This is gonna be $19.99, originally $34.99. They still have like these sweaters too. It's like a purple, blue, and black. And these are all gonna be the same price, $24.99, originally $39.99. And it does look like mostly extra smalls, extra small and small, and then yeah, extra small and small. They still have spirit jerseys over here. It's the same ones they have over at Violin. They're all $44.99. You got the retro, you have like the black Disneyland one. This one is uh, Disneyland as well. This is also Disneyland. And then this one is Disney World on the back. You can see that difference there. Also in the women's side, I've never seen this before. It's Disney Parks, Her Universe is the brand kind of like two shirts in one kind of a weird design of like this is on purpose not, but uh, that's gonna be $24.99 originally $39.99 they only have like one of those so a lot of the new stuff here too I feel like they only have like one of here's another new mini shirt too I haven't seen this is only in smalls $19.99 originally $24.99 that's kind of cool it's got like little sayings in there love I see Fabo lust that's pretty funny over in the middle too they actually have a bunch of NBA socks these are pretty cool. These are all $11.99. They got a bunch of the, you know, the big players here. They got LeBron James I see here. They got Jazz. I don't even know who that is, but I see they got Larry Bird over here. They got Clipper socks. They got Golden State Warriors. More LeBron. They got a couple Steph Curry here, two different kinds. These are all 11. They got Irving on the Sixers. That's really cool. I like that a lot. They got Giannis over here too for the Bucks. All $11.99. And then they got the Rockets too over here. So yeah, they got quite a bit of choices too. Very nice. All right, so over by the pins, and one pin I see new right away is this Live in the Island Life pin. This is the Disney Hilton Head Resort. And these are $4.99, so $5 for these. That's not too bad. I feel like those are some of the prices that we used to see here for the pins. So not, not hating that, not hating that. We saw these pins last week over at Violin. I want to say these were $8.99 over there. I, I might be wrong. But they're $6.99 now. I'll have to go look at that past video. But yeah, I think these are $6.99 now. Might be a little money off there. The only one I don't see that we saw over there was Kylo Ren. Oh no, there he is. Kylo Ren's there. So yeah, they have the same ones that they had over there. So for $8.99, they have the Mouse Party pin packs over here, the mystery packs. 
which I feel like is not bad. You get two pins for that. Let's see how many are in this set here. They got nine in the set. Let me see if I can get that to focus a little better so you guys can see what the set looks like. So that's kind of cool. But yeah, they got a ton of them here too. They do have a different Mickey pin over here that I haven't seen before either. This one's $3.99. So again, that's kind of like the older kind of pin prices. I feel like two, three, nine, nine, not bad. It's not like eight, nine, nine, like we've seen in the past couple weeks. So they actually have a really cool limited edition pin here. It looks like a key. It's got 90 on it. It also has the castle. This is going to be 26. 99 it's got the double back there too and it was originally 54.99 so that's kind of cool you can see that they got a lot of them here too and this is behind the counter so you do have to ask for these so that's actually not terrible i feel like the pin prices are actually not that bad compared to what they've been in the past i actually feel like this you know everyone always asks what's where to go violin or international i would say right now international for sure i feel like some of the prices are lower and i feel like we also have some new merchandise too now with that being said, I haven't been over to International a long time, so that might be why I think they have new merch, because while this stuff could be here for months, I wouldn't know. Where I finally know I'm going every week, so I kind of know what's what's new and what's not. But in comparison, just from you know my personal you know point of view, I definitely feel like this is better over here. So last week we saw these veggie chips over at Violin. It looks like they're really trying to get rid of them because not only are they 99 cents. But now they're two for 99 cents. Buy one, get one. They got that. And then over here, they have the Rice Krispie Treats. These are 99 cents. So that deal does not apply to these. These are only, you know, one each. But the other birthday cake ones are 99 cents. The Rice Krispie Treats. They still have these headbands for $1.99 over here. They have these at Violin. They have Simba over here. And then they have the Unicorn from uh, Toy Story, I believe. Or this, yeah. So Lion King and Unicorn headbands, uh, $1.99. And they also have like a lot of the stationary kits that they had over at Violin. So if you're afraid that they don't have them here, they do. They got like Raya, they got Toy Story, they have the princess ones that we've shown in the past. And then right over here, they got uh, Star Wars, they have Spider-Man, they got Frozen. Then they have Princess 2 and Buzz Lightyear over here. So they have all the same stationary kits that they have here. Uh, that they have a violin, they have it here. Kind of close to the checkout, they have this like Disney Parks diorama, which is kind of cool. You see, it's got like Figment, it's got Goofy. Let's see how much this is. This is $9.99 for this. And then over at International, too, they still have the Dooney and Burks over this way. They have those, you know, the bigger one tote bag. That's a $199.99. And then down below, they have the smaller one for $130. So they kind of have these little like award things too, which is kind of cool. You can see these right here. This is something different. But look, they got like a You Deserve an Award. They have the best daughter. They got the best boyfriend. Best, oh, okay, two best boyfriends. They got best son, a teacher, a grandfather. So this would be kind of cool if you're here on vacation, you want to bring something back. It looks like they even have ones that are like are empty too. And these are $199. So that's kind of cool. Like these little plaques. Uh, war packs too Maybe these best parents too they got so I have a bunch of different ones I think that's kind of cool like I was saying this would be a great gift for, for your kid to kind of bring back to like their teacher or like their friend or you know if your the grandparents didn't go or something like that that'd be kind of cool they're over by the keychains it's pretty much the same things that same ones that violin had uh, I do want to turn these around because I know these were over at violin the last two weeks they have a lot to choose from here as well these are 899 for these keychains but they have pretty much like every NBA team here. I do not see the Orlando Magic. That was one that we were missing over at Violin, but they did have it last week. I would just like to take this time to thank all my Patreon supporters, guys. The constant support you guys show me really does mean a lot, so thank you for that. I know last week on all of the comments, I was kind of saying how I didn't want to do as much Disney Character Warehouse just because there hasn't been a lot of, of new items here. I feel a little differently about that now because I feel like International kind of delivered today. Uh, they got some better choices, which I think is cool. But I think next week I'll probably will not do a Disney Character Warehouse video. I think I'm going to go to a different store that has Disney merchandise. And we're going to start doing Character Warehouse every other week. So hopefully with that too, I can kind of you know, switch over from Violin one week to you know International the next time we do. I think that's probably the best way. But I've had a hard time getting over to International. But I had some time today, so I'm glad I was able to get over here because I think it, it's paid off. So they still have Dooney and Burke over here. They have those you know cool Vince Carter jerseys. They had uh, different shorts here as well i felt like they had some different shirts too uh in the girls section also in you know just pretty much every section here they had like different shirts they have more snacks over here too they have uh, different pins over here so i thought international was actually pretty good this time comparative to violence so thank you so much for watching guys i hope you really enjoyed this one i actually had a lot of fun here today which i feel like i haven't had fun as a character in a long time but thanks again for watching guys and we'll see you on the next go around